Take two. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> right, welcome to Second Chance Studio, a mixture of music and chat with us, Mike and Leslie of Second Chance. You probably already uh, appreciate this is a pilot episode, a bit of a test, and we're going to do a couple of duets and we'll also each do a solo. Okay, so what are we going to start with? Well, uh, Keith, uh, Keith Hancock, um, The Furies. Yeah, the, the version of this, yeah. this song that we know is from The Furies, but it was written by Keith Hancock. But this is called Absent Friends. Time heals wounds, they say. Time takes the pain away. I wonder why it never happens for me. It's years since you went. Off the pile of them. Yes, yeah. okay, so if you'll excuse me, I'm going to disappear for a few moments while uh, Mike does a solo. Just going to find the cafe now, Leslie. Mm -hmm. I'll have it handy. Yeah. 
문제. This is uh, one of my favourites, uh, written by Sting, and it's called Fields of Gold. I was part of the experiment I've been watching the live stream in the other room uh, and interestingly there's a little bit of de uh, delay so when, when I went in there I actually saw myself going out through this door which is quite interesting so I came back before you'd finished the song because otherwise there would have been a big gap with you sitting there thinking well what happens now before I came back <laughs> 
So yes, I found it easily uh, and it basically picked up from the point at which I came out of the okay. door because okay. I, I thought I was going to have to watch it from the beginning and catch up. So it's, it's a bit of a learning curve, isn't it? So now we've, we have, uh, Leslie's going to do an acapella solo and it's, um, I don't know much about this, called the Terror Time. Yes, that's right. Um, I only found that out yesterday because I didn't know this. I've been singing this song for a long time. I only found out yesterday. It was written by Ewan McCall for the radio ballad about the travelling people. I knew it was about travelling people and I do sing other songs on, on the same topic. But uh, yeah, uh, the other thing is, because I learned it from people who sing in a Scottish accent, I have to sing it in a Scottish accent. Okay. Um, I, I think I'm right in saying that Ewan McCall was Scottish anyway, but I know he lived in Salford. Sorry, I don't think I've heard you saying this. Oh, right, okay, well you go watch in the other room. I'd, and, uh, left, I'd left the Bradford Arms. Yes, I sang it at the Bradford Arms on Friday uh, after um, Michael Philip had gone home. So. Yeah, because he was falling asleep, wasn't he? So. Yes, okay. that time, right. right so it, Mike's going to go and watch in the other room while I sing this uh, as part of this experiment. I can safely start before he gets there because it'll catch up by the time he arrives. I've left it running in the other room anyway, so he'll be able to see this. Okay, so this is Ewan McCall's The Terror Time. Heather will fade and the bracken will die. Streams will run cold and clear and the small birds will be going. And it's then that you'll be knowing that the terror time is nigh. The woods give no shelter for the trees they are bare. Snow's falling all around and the bernies they are greeting for the straw on which they're sleeping it is frozen to the groom and what will ye gan I and what will ye bide know that the work's all done and the farmer does need needy and the council will na heed ye, and the terror time is nigh. Now you need the shelter or your own human kind. You move nearer to an and then the sixties offending for the polis they'll be sending and you're on the road again and what will ye bide gan and what will ye bide know that the work's all done and the farmer does need need ye and the council will na heed ye and the terror time is now. I was that busy concentrating, I forgot to do the first chorus, and then I, could, I was so busy thinking what line came next that I said the wrong words, but never mind. Okay. It's all, uh, all part it's of the learning, learning curve, isn't it? Yes. So we're going to do another one together now. Uh, oh, this, this is one of our favourites, isn't it? And this is probably actually, one of the first ones we sang together. This uh, one, isn't it? Is, and this is to actually finish off the uh, yes, just to finish off the test. Uh, Polisher, although yeah. it is live and yeah. it's uh, available on. I don't, in I good, don't uh, have the all words good, available. I don't really need them. Available in all good uh, Facebook uh, yes. accounts. <laughs> we probably won't issue this particular one, but uh, yes. once we get once we get the the, the project going, we might uh, send out the link so people can have a look. People can access by chat and it's asked me just to log in. I didn't log in because yeah. I'm logged in here, but mm. you can log in to, people can log into chat and, yeah. and, and comment and request songs and all that sort of thing. Right. Okay. And, and again, this is a song where uh, we each know other versions. Um, the, the, the previous one was, uh, we, we knew the Fury's version, but it was written by Keith Hancock. This song, I know the Nancy Griffith version, 
but it was written by Kate Wolf, but you actually know Kate Wolf's mm. version. Um, so yeah. this is uh, Across the Great Divide. I've been a walking in my sleep Counting troubles instead of killing sheep Where the years went, I can't say I just turn around, they've gone away. I've been sifting through the layers, dusty books, and the faded papers. They tell a story I used to know. watching and listening to Second Chance Studio. See you again sometime. Okay, bye. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stop the live stream.